Well, a Montreal woman is cautiously optimistic that she will soon be reunited with her missing daughter. Johanna Sear was just 18 months old when she disappeared 38 years ago. Now, decades later, a woman in the United States says she could be Johanna. Tanya Kriviak has more. It's Lillian Sear's favorite picture of her daughter, Johanna. I like the suit she had on. A small envelope stashes Joanna's birth certificate, her medical book, last updated at 12 months, and pictures, Sears' lasting memories of her daughter. She loved music. Uh, she was singing when she take her bath. Now, decades later, a promising new lead. A woman in the U.S. through this Facebook page contacted Sear. I don't want to disturb you. I don't want to cause pain, neither with you or my family. But I would like, <clears throat> I would like your detective to get in touch with me, I say. What struck Sear the most is that this person had some details about Joanna, a birthmark. It's made like a Y. It's between her two finger, you know. So, and nobody knew about that. They've talked over the phone, keep in touch on a daily basis. I'm not sure a hundred percent, but I think I am Joanna. That's the first time someone come to me and say that. Still, Sir is cautiously optimistic. I think I get to stay calm. I know that happened before. Sir has had several false hopes over the years. Back in 2014, police dug up this lot, acting on a new tip from an eyewitness. They were looking for a metal box that might have contained Joanna's remains, but the search turned up empty. The woman in the U.S. is set to take a DNA test soon. It could then take up to a month to get the results. In the meantime, Montreal police say their investigation is ongoing. The Missing Children's Network says key in cases like these is to help manage expectations and emotions. Although there are striking similarities um, that can explain quite a few things, we have to remain grounded. Which is what Sir is trying to do, ready for both outcomes, but even more nervous if it's yes. What's in her mind now? How she feel now? Because there is a sense this time it could be her. Of all things, just last week, Sir got a fortune cookie. A delivery of good news will reveal you destiny. Hoping that destiny will reveal the answer she's been searching for for 38 years. Tanya Kriviak, CTV News.